Hey there, happy July 4th. I'm in Atlanta, Georgia right now and hope that you are enjoying your 4th of July as we get ready to begin another oral comm class. And I wanted to speak to you a little bit as we begin this and make sure you're where you need to be. A lot of students come into summer class hoping that they'll be able to just sort of slink on through, uh, do the least amount of work and get the grade. Um, please realize that we are theoretically covering the same amount of material that we ordinarily cover in an eight or 16 week class during the school year. And so if you've got a couple of weeks at the beach planned or you're working um, five twelves during the week, the chances of you being successful are not very high. It doesn't have anything to do with whether or not you could do the work. It doesn't have anything to do with whether or not you're intelligent enough to do the work. It's just a question of do you have time to do the work. And so I need you to think about that uh, hard as, as we begin this class. Number two, my classroom is not a place. Uh, it's not a Montessori classroom where you work through it at your own pace. There is a module per week. There are due dates within the week. This first week, everything's due Sunday because it's a short week. That won't be the case the other four weeks. You're going to have to log in early in the week, um, budget your time. And again, if you're working 5-12s, it's going to be difficult for you to do. I space it out so I have the time to try and get feedback back to you. I'm not 100% on that, but I do my best. Um, because I'm teaching you a process, a process I believe in, uh, a process that uh, experience tells me works over and over again. Uh, frankly, a process that students come back and tell me later that they use for all their papers, that they apply it in a variety of other academic disciplines. And so I believe in what I'm doing, um, and you're in my classroom. And so um, you're going to have to stay up with dates. You're going to have to budget your time so you can submit those correctly. I also try and be a, a, a fair or, or maybe a more than fair instructor. I am aware that life does happen and sometimes we can't always see everything that comes up uh, ahead of time. I, I, I do get that completely, but if you start out and you just don't really have the time, um, what it means is later you, you and I have to have awkward conversations um, about where your grade is at. I don't enjoy those. Um, also, if you don't have sufficient internet, you're going to be uploading videos. So if you don't have sufficient internet, again, it's not going to work. Um, I, I try and make it possible for you to upload in a variety of settings. It's fine with me if you just upload it to YouTube. Sometimes Canvas is a terribly slow ordeal trying to upload something, but um, you, you're going to have to have sufficient internet on your end of the world. Uh, make sure you do the course uh, attendance and course acknowledgement by Thursday. They can drop you for non-attendance in an online class. That's the official census um, for you know showing up. That's your official I'm in this class. So if you don't do it in a timely manner, you can get dropped. There are three um, pretty easy assignments this week. The third one has a lengthy video. I had trouble in my summer one class. Students just wouldn't watch these videos. And they just kept trying to turn things in that weren't the right format. And so the way that you're going to understand how I want things, how this process works, is by watching the videos. That's the way that I'm going to impart information to you. So um, I'm very pro uh, my students and I want them to succeed. Um, but sometimes in the summer we have difficulty because there's so much else going on. I have to alter my own summer plans to fit what I'm doing so that I'm able to teach. And so ask yourself some questions right now. Do I really have time to do this? Is there time in my life to do this? Uh, can I do it well? Can I do it to the quality that I would want to do it uh, to get the grade that you want? Uh, I'm going to do my part to offer concrete and what I hope is helpful feedback. 
And truly, I know a lot of people are taking this class online because they're nervous about it. And I believe that I can help you uh, become a better presenter. I just got done with a lovely student who made probably more progress in one class than anybody I've ever had. So it can be done. Uh, patience. Let's work together to help you gain some confidence. All right. Good luck to you this week.